Hello everyone. Welcome to Health Benefits Up. In today's video, we going to see the health benefits of pull-ups. Let's get started. The primary benefit that you get from doing pull-ups is that they work out your back muscles. However, having bigger muscles in your back isn't just for good looks and so you can feel good about being jacked. It actually leads to a much healthier life. Having stronger back muscles means having better posture because you can more easily hold yourself up. People don't want to see you slouched over. Also, weak back muscles often lead to having back pain, something which nobody wants to have. Working out your back through some simple pull-ups is an easy solution to all of those problems. In addition, it will make your life a lot easier because mostly all of the physical exercises you do involve using your back muscles to some degree. The next benefit that you can get from doing some pull-ups is that you can lose some weight. To be fair, doing pull-ups won't burn as many calories as doing some cardio like running on a treadmill or doing some cycling, but they will definitely burn some calories nonetheless. If you want to step up the intensity to burn even more calories you can always do more reps, more sets, do them faster, and take less time resting in between. That will definitely get your heart pumping and give your metabolism a boost. It takes calories to exercise and doing pull-ups, the last time we checked, is definitely a form of exercise. Also, doing exercise increases your metabolic rate, forcing your body to consume more energy to keep going. That means your body will burn more of the food you eat instead of storing it on your gut. Grip strength is a very important part of everyday life and so many other things, which is why pull-ups are so great. Sure you need good grip strength to actually do a single pull-up, but in doing so they also go a long way in training that same grip strength. Think about it. Your hands and fingers have to hold up all of your body weight and that serves as better grip strength training than virtually any other exercise out there. Even if you're using an assisted pull-up machine, you will still need to rely on your grip strength to be your anchor throughout the exercise. Your grip might feel sore at first, but after a week, you'll notice a dramatic improvement. This is great for all other exercises that are weight-based as you'll be able to use more weight for a longer period of time without dropping it. One of our favorite parts about the patented pull-up is that they are one of the most convenient exercises that you can do. All you need is a solid bar in your own two arms to do them. You can do them at the gym if you have a membership or would like to show off your strength, or if you want you can buy your own pull-up bar and do them from the convenience of your own home. Just make sure to get a decent pull-up bar or else you might wind up on a YouTube fail video compilation. Even better is that nowadays there are many parks out there that have some good fitness equipment for the public to use for free. We all know that doing the same workout and the same exercises time after time and day after day can get really boring so much so that you lose the motivation to keep going. That is something that is awesome about pull-ups because there are so many different variations that it is impossible for them to get boring. There is the classic wide grip overhand pull-up, reverse grip pull-ups which are also called chin-ups, and close grip pull-ups too. They are all easy to do with the same equipment so you never need to buy a new bar. Plus, each of them works out slightly different muscle groups at different levels so you can get the results that you want. Another thing that is awesome about pull-ups is that you can easily increase the intensity. Sure the normal pull-up is already hard enough as us, especially if you are out of shape, a beginner, or simply haven't ever tried doing them, in which case a few normal pull-ups will be more than enough to make you sweat. However, as you progress you can simply do more reps each time and do more sets too. Then when you really want to turn up the heat you can always strap some sandbag weights to your chest or ankles, wear a weighted vest, or even hang a kettlebell or some dumbbells to your ankles for increased intensity. If you really feel as though you need a challenge you can always try doing one-handed pull-ups too. When it comes to increasing intensity there is almost no exercise out there that is as versatile as the pull-up. 
Another thing that doing some pull-ups can help you achieve is being happier. Doing any form of exercise causes your brain to release chemicals known as endorphins, of which serotonin is the most important. Serotonin is a feel-happy chemical that gives you a sense of elation and happiness. Plus, it can also help fight mood swings, depression, and anxiety too. Another chemical that gets released in your brain thanks to exercise is something known as an endocannabinoid, which is something that makes you feel happier, more relaxed, and also contributes to feeling less pain. Hope you would have enjoyed this video. If you like this video, click the like button, comment and subscribe to our channel for more helpful videos.